to bring the best out of me. You know, I can be world top five, top three, top two fighters in fifth gear without even trying, basically, by slipping and sliding and defending. But I need the extra challenge and the motivation of one punch and it's over to bring the best Tyson Fury out. The big drama show continues. Tyson Fury says the trilogy fights with Deontay Wilder sent him into retirement. I know boxing is a grueling sport. I mean, these guys retire and they're never the same. Even the best, the best defensive fighters who get in the ring, get punched. They get hit. And they're never the same after those fights. But the all-time greats know this when they're signing up for a sport like this. And they make the sacrifice. And if Tyson Fury feels that way, he should retire. Vacate the WBC belt and get out the sport and enjoy the rest of his life. But I can't consider him the greatest of this era if he does not beat the winner of the Uzik and Joshua fight. Because to me, he fought an old Klitschko, even though Klitschko was champion for 10 years or whatever. He still beat old Klitschko. He's 37, 38 years old. And he beat an overhyped Deontay Wilder in my eyes. He has to beat AJ or Uzi because I think both of those fighters are better than Deontay Wilder, even though some people out there think Deontay Wilder the second best heavyweight in the division. Deontay Wilder hasn't won a fight in, what, three years? I still have Joshua and Uzik in front of Deontay Wilder. Good knockout power against mediocre opponents. But what top heavyweight in the division has Deontay Wilder knocked out or beaten? Luis Ortiz was like 55 years old. So far as I'm concerned, Deontay Wilder was Tyson Ferry's cherry pick, not the other way around. If you're so concerned about retiring, won't you vacate the WBC belt already? That's why I call it the big drama show. He just waiting to see what the outcome of the Uzik Joshua fight is. If Joshua wins, he's gonna come right back out of retirement, get some more lumps on his head that he complained about, and take the hundred million dollar fight. When Uzik told us that Tyson Fury wants to fight Joshua and he's scared of me, he was keeping it 100. This is what this drama show is all about. Just in case Joshua loses, he has a built-in excuse to not fight again. Because if he was really serious about hanging him up, the punishment he took in the ring, he can't take it no more, he would have vacated the WBC belt, live his happy life with his family, and retire. But that's not the case. He's waiting for August 20th. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. Jay Beasy, I'm gone.